Hello, in this video I want to show you how to pair iRobot Roomba J7 Plus with your Android smartphone and iRobot app. And to do this, first you will need to download iRobot app that you can find on Google Play Store or on uh, most of the different stores that your phone uses. Then open the app. After that, it should begin to automatically search for the robot. It doesn't found it, but uh, we can select the product instead. Go for the vacuum robot and Roomba J series. Here we can click on get started. You will also need the charging station. I have it right here, the robot and uh, access to Wi-Fi and network. Let's click on get started. Set up your charging station where you will have the Wi-Fi connection. Then place the robot on the charging station manually. It should also start, uh, this lamp should start flashing when you place it at the right spot. Just like this. My robot is ready. Then we need to connect to the Wi-Fi network and make sure that network is 2.4G since 5G networks might not work with that uh, robot. Yes, let's continue. Now it will ask for the Wi-Fi password. Continue. And in the meantime, if uh, you are unable to serve to find your robot, uh, the app is unable to find your robot. Now you might need to press on home button and the spot button at the same time for a few seconds. As you can see, it didn't found our robot, but we can pre press on those two buttons now. You will hear the chime and uh, also it will enter the Wi-Fi connection mode. Let's try again. And if this doesn't work, we might need to press on the power button as well. We'll see. Okay. Please charge Roomba. Also, let's try adjusting it to the charger. And try a different way again. So here it is. After a few tries, our robot is uh, finally visible, and we can click on the connect on this pop-up window. You are now connected to Roomba. Please use the iRobot app to complete setup. Your Roomba is completely set up and ready to go. So as you just heard, our robot is completely set up and ready to go. Um, now we can also name our robot. If you have multiple different uh, iRobot devices, it's really useful to make them uh, different. And I'm gonna just leave it as it is. So let's continue. Next, there's the introduction and there's 12 pages for it. You can read through it if you like. I'm just gonna skip through all of that. And our robot is ready. And that's it for this video. Hope you like it. Please consider subscribing to our channel, leave a like and a comment below.